Coming from Canadian junior hockey to the pro ranks is always a learning experience. Comets defenseman Jet Wu took us through that process as we bring to you a player profile presented by Penske. There's been a lot of things I've been able to learn so far. Um, things like just playing hard defense and I think that's one thing I grew up wanting to do and wanting to, to be the best at and I think just coming here I see how much more I got to work on it and continue to work on it so that and just being able to be around the older guys and see how they carry themselves is one thing I've been able to kind of see right now. Talk about the mindset of being a pro hockey player recognizing that even what you do off the ice will manifest itself on the ice as well. Yeah well kind of like you said off the ice like right now I'm living on my own it's the first time I've been able to kind of um, I guess buy groceries for myself, cook for myself, do everything myself and so I think it's good that I have that chance so that I can um, kind of bring that to the rink myself like you said, you know, how I carry myself off the ice so uh, it's, it's a good experience and um, I'm enjoying it. Is there anybody that inspired you to be the D-man you are? Uh, growing up I loved Shea Weber. Uh, I, I wanted to model my game after him, how he plays. Um, you know, like I said, defense, he always plays strong. People are scared to go down his side, scared of a shot. Um, played for Team Canada, wore the C. Like he's, you know, just all of the, he's everything I kind of want to be. Tell me about uh, Larry Wu. Tell me, tell me what kind of a man he is. Tell me what he means to you. No, he's always my dad. He uh, grew up kind of, I guess, almost like, like a lot of kids in, in, that played hockey. You know, my dad coached me growing up. Um, taught me a lot of what I've learned today. Uh, still gives me a lot of pointers and I know going, going to junior he, he, he helped me out a lot. Um, helped me kind of find my way and I think uh, you know, even in the off season he's able to find me ice or, or I'm able to work out at the gym that you know the community center that he runs. So it's it, it, he does a lot for me still even though I'm kind of on my own. Uh, but no, it's, 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 uh, it's good to have someone that's been able to go down that road a little bit. Your dad was in the movies. So your dad chose to be a movie star, you chose to be a hockey player. I think he actually he probably made a good, good pick. He was in a couple films though, wasn't he? Yeah, he was in, uh, he was in the movie Goon, I think one and two. So I think in the first movie he was um, playing hockey and studying to be a doctor or something like that. It was pretty funny. And then in the second movie, he was the team trainer, which so it just comes all the way back around. So, uh, no, when, I, when the movie came out, I, he didn't let me watch the movie. Um, he didn't want me to kind of see him in that <laughs> in that setting, but now that I'm kind of on my own, I've been able to see it. Have you seen? Is it weird for you to see your dad in a movie? So different. And I think he has a buzz cut in it too. So it, you know, the whole hair and everything, how he acts, it's completely different. So, so is this is this fodder for you to make fun of him whenever you see him, or are you just? Uh, I, I we don't we haven't talked about it too much, but uh, I know a couple of years ago he took me when the movie was first coming out. He took me to the um, I don't know what you'd call it, but he'd go and. Re redo his lines in a studio to make right. sure it was more clear because everything was in a hockey rink. And so just hearing him swear and just say things way out of context, it was just completely, just blew me away. But My last question to you, you know, you're here in a team with, I was just talking about this, a lot of young players and you're going through the same situation together with everybody. And, you know, you, we just talked to Carson Folk, we're talking to Jack Rathbone. The kids are all your age and you're all going through it together. How helpful is it to have a group of guys who are in the same part of their life trying to achieve the same goals together. I think it's, I think it's really helpful. I think um, we've all been able to have our own kind of ups and downs a little bit and um, to know that, like you said, we're all kind of in the same spot, especially with the guys you know, coming from the Blues and, and the guys from the Canucks. You know, we're all kind of bonding together and um, we got a fair share of, of rookies here, as you'd say. So uh, I think we all have each other's backs and you know, the, the older guys have also been really good about it and been able to help us. So. It's been a really good opportunity for us and we, we've enjoyed it so far.